The legal counsel to Mazen Nabucano has revealed that finally the DSS has granted the personal competent doctor to Mazen Nabucano uh, to assess his medical state and run some examinations in regards to this. Uh, what does it take DSS to make up their minds quickly than after two years, the steel took the same path they have refused for more than two years. Let me tell you the truth. Except if we are trying to, except if we are trying to pretend. The government of Nigeria wants an the candidate. But it's not going to be possible. I'm telling the truth. They want him dead. But the thing is, they are afraid. If something happens to Namde Kano, Nigeria will never be the same again. They know it. So that's why they are conscious of the, their dealings with Namde Kano. And I want to say this to the so-called DSS, or what you call them. Today they will tell you medical this thing. They will tell this. I tell people, if it were to be a Yoruba man, it would have been released. If it were to be the Hausa man, it would have been released. But because it's Namde Kano. But we both are contributing more. Listen, this morning, let me talk to my Igbo brothers. You are contributing more. Let me talk to you. We don't want to do the needful. All of you claim to love Namde Kano. You don't love him. All of you are saboteurs. You don't love him. I've suggested how we are going to release Namde Kano. Nobody wants to listen to me. Let all Igbos go on national protest. For one week, don't go to business because of Mazikano. Don't open shop for one week. All the Igbos in Nigeria, sit at home. Let us observe and say, until the card is released. The Igbos hold the economy of this country. Let me see how the Igbos going to do it without releasing the Kano. But when you suggest to an Igbo man, a foolish Igbo man, he will tell you, hey, it's not necessary. The idiot will tell you, Namde Kano is a... No! He is not ready to spear. It's just little time for Namde Kano. I've been saying this since last year. Let us go on national protest. Let us go on national protest. Including me. Let us also one day. All the holy boats in Nigeria. Sokoto, Kaduna, everywhere. Let's sit at home one week. No business. Can I paralyze the economy in this country? Until Namde Kano is released. But the boats are not ready to do that. Rather, what we have are saboteurs. Igbos are the greatest saboteurs I've ever seen. All of them will come out. I love him, Nandi Kano. You will see them gather, discussing and I see they love him. But they are saboteurs. The other day, I saw some group of guys discuss about Nandi Kano. I brought this suggestion to them. The stupid idiots were telling me it's not going to work. Imagine. The stupid fools were telling me it's not going to work. Why? I love him, Nabi Kano. I want something to be done. I just wish one day somebody could just declare all the only boys in Nigeria we are sitting down at home for Nabi Kano for one week. Then Nabi Kano we know we love him. Nabi Kano we know that his struggle is not ordinary. Nabi Kano we know that yes, indeed, this Igbos. Nabi Kano we have the strength and the power to fight more. But Igbos are not ready to do that. The sister, the sister Tom one day uh, is being opposed uh, by some Igbos uh, politicians and even the government, uh, those who have vested interests, let alone when you talk about one week. Why not start with one day? I am not saying one day. Listen, in Nigeria, I've discovered that Nigeria, if you want to hit or get something in Nigeria, make it very, make it, let it look real. Don't make it fake. It's just like strike now. NLC want to strike. All this one that is uh, a president of NLC, that one is not even a president. You want to start strike once and for all. That's what you are striking. That's what Adam did to his time. He was not ready to party anything with a passenger. Strike one is one. And he gave a passenger tough time. So, this one, guy said, doesn't know his job. That's what I'm saying. You don't say one day. Then you are saying Igbo politicians. Who are Igbo politicians? Who are they when the masses of Ndibo is talking? Oh, yeah, we politicians. Are you one or what? Who are they? I'm talking about 
masses of the Igbos speaking. Let us sit at home for one week for none they can. Do you know one day, one fool that was talking about Namdekan, when I suggested this, he was the one country in it. And I asked him, every time I see you educating people on Namdekan, say, uh, Samuel Epa. Though I don't like Samuel Epa as a person. That's my personal opinion. I don't like him. I keep saying it everywhere I go. I tell people, I don't like his pattern of uh, freedom. That's if you want to fight freedom, come to Nigeria. Namdekan, see, come to Nigeria and fight the freedom. Don't be a Finland that will be fighting freedom and telling me you are fighting. Sit at home in Apuara. You are in Finland. Come back to Nigeria. Let us struggle it out together. Not, I would appreciate a situation. This guy comes back and several governments say, You say you are looking for me. This is me. But don't stay in Finland. You are telling me you are fighting for freedom. I don't believe in that. That's why I can never believe. In Samuel Epa. So let's leave his own case. But now the canoe is somebody I believe on. Because this person, upon his father's words, upon his mother's words, don't forget that his father died in the course of Biafra. His mother died. I think his other sister died. His siblings died. And now he's still fighting the cause. Then why can't we, the Igbos, show him some respect? Why can't we, the Igbos, support him fully to say, just one week is one week too much. That's my question. One week or too much for Namdekano. One week is not too much for Namdekano. That's what I'm saying. Let us all strive for one week. I am interested in Biafra. I'm interested in Namdekano. But let us give it one week to fight this fight again with federal government. And let's see who wins the battle. That's what I can say here. So I'm just urging fellow Igbos, fellow Biafrans, let them troop out the streets. Whether you are supporting Wazurike or you are supporting Nandekano, I don't care. All I care is let every peer fans troop out to say we are going on one week. One week. One week. One week. Let us strive for Nandekano and let us see the results. That's what I can see on that aspect. Thank you so much um, for your wonderful submissions.